EtherFi, the most well-capitalized liquid restaking project, commenced the distribution of 60 million native ETHFI tokens, which were valued at an estimated $210 million at the time. This signifies the initial significant occurrence subsequent to weeks of restaking point accumulation by traders and DeFi hedge funds, during which speculators anticipated airdrops within the restaking sector. Since the debut, ETHFI has declined by more than 25% as point farmers retain their profits, as reported by CoinGecko. A blog post by Ether.fi describes ETHFI as a governance token that grants holders the ability to cast votes on issues including value accrual and the grants program of EtherFi. 11% of the tokens are distributed through airdrop, 23% are allocated to essential contributors, 27% are allocated to the project's treasury, and 32.5% are allocated to investors. This endeavor seeks to transform enthusiasm into concrete results in the restaking industry, despite the fact that Eigenlayer, the fundamental component of Ethereum restaking protocols, has not yet been released on the mainnet. The LRT project Swell declared its intention to release a restaked rollup, a layer, to constructed as an actively validated service, AVS, on Eigenlayer, last week. Let's see the further aspect of this coin from the Ether.fi price prediction. According to data from the Dune Analytics dashboard, approximately 22 million of the 60 million ETHFI tokens were claimed on Monday morning. The EtherFi protocol and the airdrop are inaccessible to US citizens. In cryptocurrency, points have recently gained popularity as a method of user acquisition. When individuals participate in a DeFi protocol, they accumulate points that frequently have an impact on subsequent token airdrop distributions, whether overtly or covertly. A cottage industry has developed for the purpose of amassing points in the restaking sector. On Wales market, users exchange points for the restaking behemoth eigenlayer, and on the DeFi app Pendle, they increase their points exposure by utilizing yield tokens. Certain decentralized asset administrators amass tokens on behalf of their clients. Recent increases in assets held on restaking protocols can be attributed to points harvesting. DeFi Llama reports that Eigenlayer has accumulated total value locked, TVL, in excess of $9 billion over the past 15 days. EtherFi's TVL has nearly tripled to nearly $3 billion during the same time period, surpassing DeFi mainstays such as Compound and Curve. In recent weeks, assets held in restaking protocols have increased, in part due to points mining. According to DeFi Llama, Eigenlayer's total value locked, TVL, has surpassed $9 billion in the past 15 days. Over the same time frame, the TVL of EtherFi has increased by over fourfold to approach $3 billion, surpassing the TVL of well-established DeFi platforms such as Compound and Curve. In the daily chart of ETHFI USD, the recent price showed a bearish pressure since the launch and found a bottom at the 3.139 level. The positive sentiment for bull came as the price rebounded from the bottom, instead of moving the launching price. In the relative strength indicator, the current reading shows a buying pressure by rebounding above the 50 line. Moreover, the MACD histogram keeps pushing higher, where the recent line maintained the higher high formation above the neutral point. In the volume structure, the largest order building was seen at 3.918, which is below the current price. As the current price hovers above this line, we may consider the buying pressure supported by larger institutions. Based on the daily EtherFi, ETHFI, price prediction, the ongoing buying pressure came from a valid trendline breakout, resulting in a bullish impulsive wave. In that case, the primary aim of this buying pressure would be to test the 8.660 level, which is the current all-time high. On the flip side, a failure to hold the price above the high volume line or creating selling pressure from the 7.000 level with a new high volume formation could be a potential bearish signal. In that case, the downside pressure might extend to the 3.000 psychological line. In the H4 TIM frame, a bullish impulsive wave is visible, where the current price hovers above the monthly high level. Moreover, the recent buying pressure is supported by the dynamic Key Jensen level, which could be an additional sign of a buying pressure. The indicator window shows the same story, where the current histogram is bullish above the neutral point. Moreover, the signal lines are at the highest level in the last two months, creating a downside possibility as a mean reversion. Based on the H4 structure, ongoing buying pressure might take the ETHFI price above the 7.000 level soon. 
Moreover, the prolonged buying pressure might create a new all-time high by reaching the 20 level by the end of 2015 and the 50 level by the end of 2028. Based on the current EtherFi price forecast, ETHFI has a higher possibility of growing in the future. The primary aim of this instrument is to take the price above the current all-time high level. Moreover, a stable market above the 7.00 level could be another achievement for this coin, in the path to the all-time high line.